We're here at Nacion Station, a major hub in southeastern central Paris. And this station is served by Line A of the RER, as well as Paris Metro's Lines 1, 2, 6, and 9. So it's quite a massive hub, and the station is named after Place de la Nation, which is located above. Um, I like the RER A platforms. They're large and spacious. Disneyland service coming.
we're gonna head to the Paris Metro lines now, starting with line one. And, and oh my goodness, this corridor is absolutely rubbish. It's just, I think the ugliest corridor in a Paris Metro station. The entire station is managed by RATP. the other platform as well no 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 actually straight ahead is the other aria platform and to the right is the exit and lines one two six and nine this one this corridor is very quiet but also very dangerous. Here's a map. So here you have Nacion, and it's the terminus of lines two and six, but lines one and nine go through it. Here's a connecting ticket hall and I'm going to sell my ticket. There are several exits here. I don't know if I'm going to separate entrances into line 9. The first one led to line 1. So like this this one here is to the Montreal platform. You can hear the trains above. This one heads to Pont de Sèvre, which is near Versailles. Here you have Metro 1, La Défense, Metro 2, Port Dauphine, and Metro 6, or Charles de Gaulle Etoile. Here's another escalator. already done it successfully, but Paris should do it too, don't you think? This way to the La Defense platform. And this way is to the Chateau de Vincennes, line 2 and 6 platforms. You see map. And why does it show two Nations on this map? God, I to be changed this immediately. But this heads all the way to La Defense, or Paris's Canary Wharf. And there are two entrances into, into, the, into this line 1 platform. Right now we're crossing above line one at the moment. And then here at Nation, line one turns south there. Oh wait, 
You can see the line two platforms here. That's cool. That's line one. It's on a curve. Here. So platform edge doors have to do like so much work. Okay, this train is now named for Chateau de Vincennes. Palace of Signals or yeah, like square like signals, not, not like circular ones. They're pretty one of a kind on the Paris Metro. You can hear line two. This is the terminus of line two. So many people running for the train. Let's go to line two now. And we've got some action there. That way is towards line six, which is for Charles de Gaulle Twilight. That way. There's another exit. Here's a map of it. We've got Nassion, Avron, around the northern edge of Paris. The Charles School de Troyes, even serving Jury and Stalingrad, and even La Chapelle, which would which actually links up with Gare du Nord, but not really. And all the way down to Port Dauphin, which should not be the terminus. No. And Line 2, is, this is the eastern terminus of Line 2, as I've told you several times already, and it's on a loop line, so trains can reverse here at the station and continue up back on their journey, which is kind of cool. And trains can depart here from either platform.
I can say MF01 rolling stock prepare to leave for Port of Fiend. box style sign and that way is towards line one across the bridge. This train is now going to leave for Port Dauphin. is also where Line 2's depot is located, but this here is something really fascinating. Here, you can see the street above, uh, some, so you've got natural light penetrating into the station. That's really cool, a bit like the Circle District, Hammersmith City and Metropolitan Line stations. We've got another Line 2 service, and our former service back to Porto This way heads down to the RERA platforms, but here's a map of the Paris Metro network. So here's Nation, line 2 goes around the city, serving Joy, Stalingrad, La Chapelle, Barbes, Rochelle, Schwartz, etc. Here it says Montmartre with Anvers Station, and all the way around to Arc de Triomphe, Charles de Toile, all the way to Port Dauphine, and it forms a northern arc. Line 6 is the opposite in having the southern arc of the city and so it serves destinations like Chocardi Road, the Eiffel Tower with Berhakim it even has Gare Montparnasse uh, Place de Tali where lines 5 and 7 also come even Bursu where line 14 comes and runs all the way to Nassion where it even has its own loop This train will now leave. And those are the stairs that I came down upon and I videoed the train here and then I went into the line one platforms. Well what is it over there? I'm not too sure. down towards line six, I think. Hmm. Line six. God, there's two ways to line six. I'm not sure which one is the correct one then.
I'm pretty sure this is the way to line six. Line sits on the southern half of the station. Let's have another light box sign. It falls in one night. its next stop. And the next stream will depart from this platform. So if you like terminuses which are loop lines, they alternate between platforms for departures. We're heading down to line nine. And I think line nine might be my favorite Paris Metro. Here's my knife. Wait a second, I'm on the wrong platform. Sorry, um, but I'll transition over to the, to the correct one. Natasion.
spelling mistake. Trains are shorter than the length of the platform.